Today I'm keeping my look really simple. I'm wearing my signature Angie's Hair Studio shirt along with a sleeveless blazer, one of my favorites. Of course, I can't forget my book and my product. Okay guys, I am on my way to Channel 5 um, to do an interview. I will be talking about the beauty industry. So that fits me, I think. <laughs> And um, I'm on my way there and I'm gonna take you guys along with me for some behind the scenes uh, footage of my interview. So stay tuned. Okay, I just arrived to channel five. I think I'm trying to keep my cool by looking through this magazine because Lord knows I wasn't reading anything. <laughs> I think arriving early doesn't help because it just makes me more nervous. Okay, now I'm in the back. Just working things out, trying to figure out where do I set my products up at or do I need it now? Uh, should we add videos later to the footage? Okay, so I am getting mic'd. That means we are about to get started. But wait, I put on these bracelets and they are loud because I'm banging my hand on the desk so I ran away to my car. No, I'm just joking. <laughs> I ran away to put my bracelets away. <laughs> I'm back. Welcome to Bounce Around Charleston. Thank you, Randall. Thanks for having me. Yes. Okay, now, you're an entrepreneur. I am. And you've got a wonderful product I think all the women would like to know about. Tell us about it. Well, actually, it's for men, women, and children wow. with all hair types. Okay. And it's called Quick Clean Hair Mist. Quick Clean Hair Mist. Yes, it cleans your hair while on the go when you don't have time to shampoo. It's a no-rinse, all-natural cleansing mist. So it's great wow. for post-workouts hospital stays, for scalp care, for beards as well. And like I said, it's for all hair types. I didn't want to leave anyone out when all creating this hair product. Types. All hair types. Okay, what motivated you to start this product? Well, I've been in the beauty industry now for 25 years, and I started, um, you know, working countless hours behind the chairs. I've traveled. I worked. At, I did platform artistry for Revlon. I've been on movie sets, and I just listened to what the clients what they wanted. They've been complaining, oh God, what do I do? I don't want to fully shampoo my hair after I work out. Or my mom is sick in the hospital, her hair or scalp needs to be clean. What do I do? So I just took it in for, throughout the years and it just came to me like a light bulb to develop my product, Quick Clean Hair Mist. And you did all of this right here in the Low Country. I did, I did. It's been, um, it took about a couple of years of full production and with manufacturing it, getting it labeled, getting it tested, getting in everything and now it's on the shelves and my business partner is Walmart. I'm with Walmart as well, walmart.com and various Walmarts across the United States. And so a person can go get this product. Yes. I just worked out. I don't yes. have time to shampoo or like you just said, I'm in the hospital and I really can't shampoo my hair, mm -hmm. but there is a product that I can spray on my hair to help clean my hair and my scalp. Exactly, it's very innovative. There's nothing like my product on the shelves. Mm -hmm. And it's so easy to use, you just spray, 
you massage it in or you comb it in, you use a wet, warm cloth. It's almost a nice massage that goes mm -hmm. on along with it, and that cleans your scalp, and you just style as usual. Rather, you would blow dry or go under the dryer or whatever. It's that easy. Wow. So, um... What kind of feedback have you gotten? Oh my God, the feedback has been awesome, especially for my locals. I'm so, um, I appreciate all the local feedback that I've gotten, even though it's across the United States, but the reviews has been wonderful. I've been told it's a lifesaver. Mm -hmm. um, I've told it has softened my husband's beards. So the ladies really like that. <laughs> <laughs> you know, when the beards get a little crunchy and yeah. sticky and you know, they hold a lot of germs. So this product really helps with that, so. Yeah, so I can't get enough of the feedback. <laughs> can't get enough of it. Okay, so um, if a person needs to get this product, what do they need to do? It's easy. All you can do, you can go to Walmart.com and it can be sent right to you. You can even have it sent to your home or a Walmart store, or you can go on a Ravenel.com we can send it out to you as well, or you can go on the website, aravenel.com, and get the list of all the Walmarts mm -hmm. that's it, that it's in across the United States. Okay, so that's, okay, thank you for that. Yes. So let's talk <laughs> back a little bit about your history. Okay. So you've been in, in the uh, in the beauty industry. Yes. And you, like, a, you do it. I do hair, I do makeup, I'm also a photographer, I'm an author, I wrote my book Makeup 101 with me Angie Ravenel, and um, yeah, I've been vlogging now, and I'm doing a lot of videos, I used to do that a long time ago, and the product just took so much of my time, so now I'm back into vlogging and YouTubing, so um, yeah, I've been really busy in my mm -hmm. industry, it's just a full circle, one thing helps the next thing. So if a person picked up Makeup 101, what will they discover? They'll discover it's for the everyday woman. It's, it brings you back to the basic as to how to use foundation, how to pick foundation, the type of brushes you need to use. It's the basic. It's a 56 page mm -hmm. full color tutorial and um, it's great for teens too. Mm -hmm. Makeup 101. Yes. So when they open this book and they begin to read and they they're finished reading this magazine, they'll know how to put their foundation on. Yes, with confidence. With, wow, I like that. Yes, with, with, confidence. with confidence. And that's the base of my book. I talk to so many people, they don't know how, they're, they're unsure. So this book, break, it breaks it down for them on how to use makeup with confidence. Mm -hmm. Yes. Now what more, what, started you to write this? I think it was a, just a challenge for me. I like to challenge myself. Okay. And so I said, you know what, I want to write a book. And then I, you know, put that off to the side. And then I started. And mm -hmm. once I got started, I'm the type of person, I like to complete things. I like to challenge myself and just uh, see it the whole way through. Mm -hmm. And I did. And I accomplished my, my challenge. So, and then it's for everyone now. So anyone can benefit from using the book. Now, you've always had a love for art. I did. Now, how does that play into your life? Well, I was told as a child that I was going to be a cartoon artist. I used to I used to draw a lot or whatever. But now I think I've taken it in a different way. Everything I do is full of art. My photography, mm -hmm. that's art. Makeup mm -hmm. is art. Styling hair is art. Mm -hmm. Creating a product, it's art. So everything's just kind of, it's artful. Yeah. So even you apply your makeup, it's like applying art. Oh, yes, because there aren't any rules. Even though some people like to go by rules, mm -hmm. you know, like don't do this or don't do that. But once you get past the basics, that's when you can have fun with it. Wow. Mm -hmm. Are there any major stars or actors that you that have you know, you've worked with? Yes, I have worked with uh, several of them, especially on the movie sets. I've done photography, and I, I, God, I can't remember his name. But anyway, he's a famous actor, and um, he played in Malcolm X and, and things like that, and we built such a great relationship. I did his photography uh, for a magazine. Okay. So yeah, I, I've been around. <laughs> okay, Angie Ravenel, you have Makeup 101 and? Quick Clean Hair Mist. Quick Clean Hair Mist. Yes. Okay, and you pick it up, as you said, in Walmart. Yes. We thank you for being here on Bounce Around I Charleston you, Randall. today. Thanks for having and me. And I wish you the very best. I appreciate you. And everything that you're doing. Thank you. Okay, you heard it right here on Bounce Around Charleston. You can get a product to help you clean your hair, and there's a book to tell you how to work your makeup. You heard it here from yeah. Angie Ravenel. <laughs> okay, thank you very much for being here. And coming up next. I do that when I'm doing my um, editing. <laughs> I forget I'm mic'd and then I go run off in the kitchen or something and I'm dragging it's everything behind me. Exactly. <laughs>